Here, we're going to look at how we can order fractions and decimals. It may help to view our video on how to convert fractions, decimals and percentages before starting. Consider a question like this. We need to order these in ascending order. This means from smallest to biggest. However, because they all have different denominators, we cannot currently compare them. We could convert them all to decimals, but dividing by large denominators can be tricky without a calculator. What we can do is look for a common denominator, a number that is a multiple of all four denominators. The lowest common multiple of our numbers is 30, so we will look to find equivalent fractions with a denominator of 30. As 13 over 30 already has a denominator of 30, we do not need to change it. Can you see how we can change the other three? To find the equivalent fraction for 7 over 10, we need to see how many 10s there are in 30. 30 divided by 10 is 3, so each value in the fraction needs to be made 3 times larger. Can you work out the equivalent fractions for the other two? Pause the video and have a go. We apply the same process for the other two. There are six fives in 30, so we multiply the numerator 3 by 6, giving us 18 over 30. As there are five sixes in 30, we multiply the other numerator 4 by 5, giving us 20 over 30. We can then order by comparing the numerators from smallest to largest, then convert them back to their original form. This method is useful if you have large denominators that are difficult to divide by, such as 17 if you don't have the use of a calculator. The method of finding equivalent fractions is also useful for adding and subtracting fractions. If you liked the video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Comment below if you have any questions. Why not check out our Fusco app as well? Until next time.